Hello. My party, the People's Democratic Party, PDP, has instituted an action at the Federal High Court Abuja Judicial Division in suit number FH stroke ABJ stroke CS stroke 650 stroke 2021, PDP versus INEC and five others challenging the virus of the Zafara State House of Assembly as presently constituted to commence impeachment or any other proceedings against the Deputy Governor of Zafara State elected on the platform of the PDP. You will recall that the Federal High Court has granted an order directing the maintenance of the status quo antebellum by the court on the 19th day of July 2021. The court order has served on the Chief Judge of Zamfara State, Zamfara State House of Assembly, and the Governor of Zamfara State. Notwithstanding, the service of the said court order, Mr. Emmanuel C. Okala San and distinguished life bencher wrote a letter to the Honorable Speaker of the Zamfara State House of Assembly, drawing the attention of the Speaker and the House of Assembly to the court order and the suit number FH stroke ABG stroke CS stroke 650 stroke 2021, PDP versus INEC and five others challenging the virus of the Zamfara State House of Assembly as presently constituted to commence impeachment or any other proceedings against the Deputy Governor of Zamfara State elected on the platform of the PDP. Despite the foregoing state of affairs, the Speaker of the Zamfara State House of Assembly and the House of Assembly have now embarked on steps and actions to overreach the pending suit, disobey the court order, render the effect of the suit negatory by scheduling a sitting to proceed with impeaching, impeachment proceedings on Thursday, 29th July 2021, today, against I, the Deputy Governor of Zamfara State. I am, I am of the honest view that action will be proper, improper, indecorous, inappropriate, and unlawful as it constitutes disobedience to court order and will be tantamount to a flagrant breach of law and initiated in a host of Supreme Court cases, such as the Supreme Court cases of Boswani versus Savala, 1972, um, Ojuku versus Governor of Lagos State, 1983, and Mohammed versus Olawini, 1993. These cases have laid down the principle which has become time-honored and settled law beyond peradventure where there is pending application pursuant to an appeal before a court. No action aimed at or capable of foistering the court a fate accompli by render its decision negatory should be taken or entertained. In fact, the parties should not engage itself in speculation by concluding or assuming that the application before the court will fail because an action before a court is the civilized way of enforcement and maintenance of the legal rights and a person that takes that course of action should not be silenced or forced to abandon or renounce his right to complain. I am constrained to draw the attention of the public this ugly situation in the matter in the hope that well-meaning citizens and people of goodwill will call the House of Assembly of Zamfara State to order and impress upon the need to obey the subsistent order of the court and respect the judicial process to exercise restraint and await the outcome. Thank you for your understanding and listening. The court order sent to the House regarding the issue of the said impeachment is out of contest. The House has never in the last two weeks or in the last 48 hours uh, seen that uh, it has the intention of uh, impeaching the Deputy Governor. Uh, it has never stated in the, uh, the floor of the House during the plenary, uh, during the debate of the House, it has never stated in any way that um, the House wanted to impeach the Deputy Governor. The House is having an allegation with the Deputy Governor. He wanted, they wanted him to appear and tell the House why such a rally uh, took, took place at the period of a mourning period when over 56 innocent lives were lost by bandits. So uh, the House knew what it means by impeachment and it has never stated anything like impeachment. So the House wonders why the issue of impeachment even came in and uh, the, 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 the Deputy Governor went straight ahead to make uh, uh, something which is not out of nothing. 
So the House did not even acknowledge the issue of impeachment. And when that letter was read on the floor of the House, the Speaker allowed for the debate of the, house, of the letter and it was sent to the legal department of the House for them to look at it critically and report back to the House in an appropriate time.